My name is Brett Trigano. I'm an aquatic biologist with Cortha Conservation. I've been here for about 10 years in the Environmental and Technical Services Department. My main responsibilities include drafting the lake management plans and undertaking science within the lakes. My name is Emily Johnston. I'm the Stewardship Outreach Technician here at Kawartha Conservation. I work with a group of people in the Stewardship Department and we all work together to help landowners make good, good decisions for their land. Um, this is an excellent position for me to be in because environmental stewardship has always been really important to me. And now in my daily work, I get to go out and help people make good decisions for their property and for our watershed and community as a whole. Uh, Lake Management Plan is basically a document that provides several recommendations on how to maintain or improve the health of the lake and its drainage basin. And when we're talking about health, uh, it's mainly in reference to water quality, but also includes other aspects uh, such as the quantity of water, so how abundant it is, uh, productive fish and wildlife populations, and thriving local economies. Several lake plans have been developed, uh, one for each of the major lakes within the municipality of City Quartha Lakes. Each of the lake plans is basically three components. The first component is a summary of the state of the lake, so the existing science. The second piece is the management objectives. So what does the lake community or the lake stakeholders want uh, in their lake and for their lake? And the third component is a series of management recommendations. Many of the lakes have not been studied extensively since the 1970s. So this project represents the most current state of the science and the most current management objectives or what the community wants to see for the health of their lake. The stewardship department at Kawartha Conservation consists of a variety of tools and resources that are designed to help landowners make the best decisions in terms of stewardship for their land that are, that are possible. Um, we have technical documents, we can do site visits, we can offer advice and we can help them find cost sharing programs which make it financially easier to implement some of these stewardship actions and when people are able to do that everybody benefits so that's a great thing. Uh, farmers have a particularly large stake in managing the lakes simply because they own or actively farm most of the acreage uh, within the drainage basins. Farming and lake management are more connected than you may think. Uh, for example they face a lot of the same pressures. Uh, nutrient and soil management concerns. You know, just finding the right balance between not enough nutrients in the land and water and too much. Nutrient uh, leaching and soil erosion are two primary concerns for lake managers and farmers as well. Within each management plan, uh, the recommendations are presented within five strategies. Stewardship, strategic planning, urban and rural infrastructure, research and monitoring, and communications and outreach. We have these stewardship programs because most of the land in our watershed is privately owned. So the whole reason for the program is to connect with those landowners and be a support for them so that we can work together to reach our collective goals, which is a healthy watershed. It's really important to, to engage with the landowners and to, to work with them to, to reach these goals. We really enjoy working with farmers. Uh, because they provide innovative solutions for all these different problems um, that we encounter on a day-to-day -day basis. Um, they know the landscape, they've been farming there for generations. Uh, they often can tell us um, what we need to know in terms of water quality and quantity uh, before we even get out there and study it. Two of the first things you say to yourself uh, when, you, when you travel throughout the region is, you know, Wow, look at all the healthy and beautiful lakes, and wow, look at the beautiful farmland. So landowners can get help just by reaching out. Give me a call, check our website, and send us an email. Um, let us know what you're interested in doing, what sort of barriers you may be facing, what you need in order to achieve your goals, and we are here to help. We're here to try to find those answers for you and to provide the supports and the tools that, that you need in order to make good stewardship decisions on your property.